National Anthem over with. Good evening from the South Okanagan Event Center in Penticton. My name is Chase Johnston, the voice of the West Kelowna Warriors. You are listening, you are watching to Murray's Pizza. West Kelowna Warriors Hockey on Hockey TV and Mixler. It is the now 31-6-0-2 Penticton Bees hosting the now 23-13-1 West Kelowna Warriors. Defoe. Back inside the V zone, plays it back for Crystal, goes to John Evans. Evans, not much room, plays it back. There's a one-time drive, my goodness, Tyson Jugnoff, and the helmet comes popping off Caden Lane. And that is a 6 p.m. drop, so two big games this weekend. It's a big weekend, just in general, for the Warriors who are trying to keep up with the Prince George Spruce Kings. And look out, we got a turnover here, they score! Josh Nadeau and some sloppy play by the Warriors' decor in their own end. And ran out of space and time real quick. And now Joggin will try and take advantage. And look out, Brett Moravec, short ended breakaway here. Moravec in, save made by Johnny Derrick. Up top to Stefano Bettini. Ethan Mann inside. Cross ice pass, goes back to Doyle. Hopkins, look over the give and go, play to Mann, nobody home. Instead, the V's, great position of the puck, play it back up top for Josh Nato, the goal scorer. Nato. Left side to Bradley Nato. Bradley Nato, save made, rebound loose. Where is it? It's behind the net. Another pass just misses wide. Struggling to clear, it will now bounce back to Barlovise and the Warriors under a little bit of siege here to start period two. Beanie Richter steals a puck away, wide open. They get a tip on, save made by Derek. It beat Derek, went off the post, and then Derek smothered it without knowing where the puck was. Jurasevich there to clear. Puck goes back and kept in by Alexi Van Hukachero. Van Hukachero now has it. Van Hukachero pass down low, looking for Joggin. And Marcus Joggin's going to draw a penalty here. Warriors are going to go on their second power play of the evening with 14.31 to go here in period number two. Leaves it back for Brennan Nelson. Nelson up top, Lego. Good shift here by the Warriors. Nelson looking for a tip. Rukanakis, sharp angle, save made, rebound. Oh, that's two quality stops made by Caden Lane. Puck held in again by the Warriors as the pressure continues here by West Kelowna and it will go off the boards and Caden Lane covers up. That was the best shift. Nelson out there with Rukanakis, Ardenaz and Lawn. We'll more than likely see Brennan Nelson go off for a change. Brennan Nelson finishes his check right at the Tim Hortons logo. It's the pouncing puck not benefiting anybody right now. Arnott, Hopkins, Hopkins a shot through traffic. Puck is loose. Oh, and Moravec has it. Moravec looking for the pass. Nobody home. Had it lost in his skates. V's trying to take advantage. McDonald throws it on net. Save made by Derek. Rebound loose. Johnny Derek with a huge save. And the puck resting right near the uh, net. And Josh Nado, he's got the only goal in this game. As he wraps it around for his younger brother, Brad Nado. Shot on, tipped. Save made by Derek. Play resumes. And Charles Alexis Lego. Oh my goodness, you felt that one. Nobody there for the Warriors. And the V's now will take advantage. Across, one time drive, save made by Johnny Derrick. Oh my goodness. The best save of the game goes to the Warriors goaltender. And he keeps it a one goal game. Nato another shot, another save by Derrick. Another drive, they score. You can only give the Penticton V's so many opportunities. Second opportunity here as they now carry the puck inside. Josh Nato already two points tonight as he set up that goal by Josh Niedermeyer. Puck goes back to Doyle, across. Luciana Wilson tipped on, they score. It's Josh Nato again. And Arden has trying to clear. He'll leave it back for Defoe. Defoe outlet pass, short handed breakaway for John Evans. Evans in, Evans save made by Caden Lane. And the Warriors needed that one. Batted away by the paddle of Caden Lane. Going back the other way is Isley, Isley takes a high hit there from Charles Alexis Legault. Isley goes down. Niedermeyer, left side point, shot on, another blocked play. And look out, John Evans looking for another one of those breakaway passes. Evans in, scores! We've seen John Evans lurking around the V's blue line looking for those breakaway passes. He wasn't successful the first time on the shorthanded break. The second time... He is. The Warriors are on the board. That is their first goal they've scored inside the South Okanagan Event Center this season. Bees have a look. Play it back to the right side circle. Shot on. Nato. And there was a wide open rebound. Luckily for the Warriors. Charles Luxus Lego just got in front of it. Now, potential shorthanded break here for the Warriors. Brennan Nelson turns on the Jets. Nelson in. He rings it off the post. 
Oh, wow, what a burst of speed there by Brennan Nelson. And Hopkins again, kind of losing an edge, allows the Warriors. Evans gets a shot off short-handed. Huge save made by Caden Lane. And another face-off, trying to get a last-second shot on was Crystal. And unfortunately for the West Corner Warriors, they run out of time. The Bees win their 11th straight game. The Warriors, that's a tough loss. And John Evans giving it to the official. He really didn't like that call and that very dangerous play from Owen Simpson. And I don't think any West Kelowna Warriors fans did either. And you better believe the West Kelowna Warriors social media is going to be blowing up about that play for those of you who tuned in to watch the final minute of play. That was a very dangerous play on one of the league's top players in John Evans.